move. I will be in a bikini top selling my hot dogs. They do it in Florida. They could do it in New York too. So today, when the judge said, "Do you plead guilty to prostitution?" Of course, you said, I said, "No, oh, yeah, I'm a stripper." Uh, come, come I don't. I don't think I'm indecent exposure lot. is prostitution. I don't see it. Come in the parking lot. We're gonna do this. Uh, want to talk to us? Come in the parking lot. I don't see indecent exposure prostitution. There's no sexual act. If a guy could walk down the street with no shirt on, so can I. <laughs> Listen, if a guy could walk down the street with no shirt on, so can I. And if he don't get charged with prostitution, why should I? Am I correct? Are we good? Back up. Back up. Can, we, can we all move back a little down the ramp? Is that all right? Well, yeah, because we're not. We're Okay, guys, indecent exposure is not a prostitution. I just oh, want you to know that. You gotta come in the parking lot. Yeah, I'm sorry. Listen, I've been a topless dancer since I'm 19 years old. I love my job and everything. And I worked at the Bare Necessities in Island Park. When it shut down, I had no job. So I started a hot dog truck. And I started showing my cleavage and giving out my business cards. Next thing you know, I have the cops up my charging me with prostitution when I'm not even a prostitute. So where where is the prostitution coming You pleaded in? guilty today to prostitution. I plead guilty to stripper. A stripper. Not prostitution. No, the judge prostitution is sex. Listen, I'm Sister Teresa over here, okay? Showing you cleavage is indecent Josh, exposure. Prostitution is sex. Sexual acts. That's prostitution. That showing hurt? showing your is indecent exposure. So where where is the sex? A minute. There's no sexual services. Did you ever offer somebody? And that? they gave me an HIV test, STD test. Every sex test they gave me was all negative. I have nothing. I have no herpes. I have no AIDS. I have nothing. I am clean. I'm a mother of four kids. And yes, I show my cleavage. I think it's sexy. If Pamela Anderson can do it, so can I. What, what, what happens when you give someone your card and they come to your house? What happens at your house? I do a strip. Topless, lap dancing. You know, like in a strip club. How you much ever, do you charge? You ever go to a strip club? No. I charge 100 bucks. And is that But legal? topless and lap dancing. In your house? It's in the privacy of my house. I think it's legal. Getting back to the truck, you say you'll be back out there tomorrow? I'll be back out there with my bikini top on selling my hot dogs. I'm right in front of Pep Boys in Baldwin and Freeport. I have loads of customers. Everybody loves me. Nobody has a problem. I have no complaints. I've been there for two months now. No complaints. And then I had the cops come. I solicited my business card. Yes, I did. It's a topless dancing card. And the cop called me up and he said he wanted topless dance. And he came over my house. I gave him a topless dance like this, sexy and I know it, okay? I gave him a little lap dance. Next thing you know, he asked me for a I had 20 cop cars there with handcuffs on me, charging me with prostitution. When he asked, what did you say? I said, no, they don't have the tape. I said, give me the tape. I want the proof. I want the proof that I was going to give this guy they have no proof. What did you say about all this police attention to you when there are other crimes out there? You know what? These girls that got killed in, in the beach, okay? They should find that serial killer. They're worried about a stupid stripper when they got a serial killer out there. Go find that guy. I've been a stripper all my life. I never, I never got into problems and stuff like that, you know, I feel bad for these girls. These girls were just starting out on the Craigslist, and I've been doing this all my life, and I just, God bless me. God bless me and my kids that I got through the stripping business alive. You are aware that the charge you pleaded guilty to today is right. a charge of prostitution. No, I'm not pleading I'm not pleading guilty to prostitution. I'm pleading guilty to being a stripper. All right, a stripper and a prostitute are two different things. But you did, but you did All right. prostitution. Guilty. I mean, no. there's a charge you pleaded I guilty pleaded to. I pleaded guilty to being a stripper. That's what I am. Did you sign paperwork saying that? Did you sign anything? No, I didn't sign anything. But that's what I pleaded guilty to. Okay, prostitution is a sexual act. Prostitutes have sex with men. I don't have sex with men. I just show my...
the men. So there's no sexual contact. So that's indecent exposure. So the only thing they could charge me with is twice indecent exposure. Because I don't have, okay, I only had sex with my husband for 15 years, okay? I've been with my husband 15 years. I was a happily married woman. I have four beautiful children. I have nothing. My kids have nothing. My husband has nothing. We're all clean family. Do you advertise on Craigslist? No, I do not. I have a little business card that says, I'm a stripper and I know it. So tomorrow when you're back at your hot dog truck, right. are you going to still be handing out your business cards and offering yes. strippers? Stripper? Yes, I'll, I'll be a stripper to the day I die. I love it. I enjoy it. I have fun. I do it for fun, actually. Not for all this attention with prostitution and everything. I do it for fun, to have a good time. All right, thank okay, you. I do, I, I do acrobatical <laughs> stuff. I, you show us a little? You want, all right, who wants to get a lap dance? I'll show you what it looks like. Come on, let's go. We're going to go back into the 90s. See, I'm back from the 90s where topless dancing and bachelor parties and lap dance, that was all in back then. See, nobody bothered you with prostitution. Now, in the year 2000, we're in the next generation where it's all prostitution now. Now, I think those girls that were on the beach, they were innocent, they were going to do a strip, and this guy just like flipped out on them. That's what I think. I think they were all innocent.